All right, is Donald Trump serious about a run for the White House? Will his reignition of the birther controversy prove a viable strategy? Donald Trump joins us now by the phone. Uh, Mr. Trump, thanks for being with us. Good morning. If you want to be taken seriously as a presidential candidate, do you think this issue of the president's birth is the most serious issue facing the country that you could use your considerable profile and popularity to raise? Or does it feed into the perception that this is just kind of a sideshow? Well, I do think it's a serious issue, Savannah, but I also think that a lot of people, frankly, like yourselves and Joe and Mika, uh, they bring it up as the first question, Bill O'Reilly who's on tonight, and we're going to discuss China and other things. But the fact is that Bill O'Reilly, the first question he asked me was about the Bertha. Is going to catch headlines. You could downplay it. Well, no, you I could, am you embracing could end the this issue. right now if you wanted to. I am embracing the issue, and I'm proud of the issue. I think somebody has to embrace it because, frankly, the people that are, and I don't like the name Bertha, but the, because I think it's very unfair and I think it's very derogatory to a lot of very good people that happen to think that there's a possibility that this man was not born in this country. And by the way, if that were true, you know, it's very interesting. If that were true, it would be the greatest, greatest scam in the history of this country. So, so I feel that there is certainly a chance that he was not born in this country. Now, if he were not born in this country, that means he can't be president. It's very simple. Arnold okay. Schwarzenegger but, cannot but, run for president because he Mr. wasn't Trump, born in the country. The problem really that I have think? is it's hit such a nerve that yeah. every time I talk to you and Chuck, who I respect dearly and greatly, as you know, I think you're two great pros. But look at the first question you asked me. It's about the birth. Why don't you ask me about China? Why don't you ask me about the fact that OPEC is ripping us off? Why don't you ask me about the fact that the Arab League is asking us to fight and they're not paying us for it? I mean, well, I'd let love me ask you, to you this, that, though. But you start with no, the no. oh, Wait a minute. That's. But why, let me ask you this. Why do you believe this? When do you really believe? that the Clinton machine, circa 2007, actually didn't spend some time looking in this. Do you really believe that John McCain and the Clinton campaign really would have rolled over and participated in this grand conspiracy? That's what I've never understood about. It's not that much of a conspiracy. It's very simple. It's an incredible conspiracy. This. It's not that the, much the, of a conspiracy. It's very simple. It's an incredible conspiracy.